because we've got so much, you know, it's summertime and lots of people are going to be traveling and more and more of us are able to travel internationally. Coming back into the U.S., you have to go through passport control. Of course, you have to do that in other countries, too. But as a U.S. citizen, you have the ability to sign up for global entry, which is like it includes pre-check. But, you know, I'll call it pre-check in reverse. It gives you the fast lane when you are coming back in through uh, through immigration control into the U.S. through passport control. If you do not have global entry, there are two other lines available to U.S. citizens. One is the cattle call line that everybody else gets in and it's long and Therefore, slow, not that the people that are processing it are slow, but there's just more people in line to be processed. And then between the global entry line, which is short and fast, I didn't even have to give my passport this last time, Pete. I just like they you took my, your global entry card in a little machine. I, I didn't or, know. I mean, it, scan, it scans the barcode on your global. It scanned card. my face. Huh? I didn't. I, it, you don't need your global entry card for uh, for flying. You need it for uh, land crossings. Okay. But your passport's in it. But yeah, it just, it, it saw my, I guess my retina scan. And that was the end of that. They're like, yeah, you're good to go. Here's your receipt. Go to the front. Uh, but there's a short little line in between the cattle call line and the global entry line. And that is for people using the free to use mobile passport app. I mentioned this to my son because Lisa and I have global entry, but my two kids do not. And he, as we were getting off the plane, walking down the corridor of the plane and then the corridor in Boston Logan, he put both his passport and uh, his sister, my daughter's passport into the mobile passport app, processed it, said, yep, we're here, did all the things, walked right up to the front. They were almost through faster than we were with global entry. So, and they didn't have to go through the whole global entry interview process. Yep. Yep. Anybody can do it. It's free. It doesn't cost any like there's no you don't have to do anything in advance. Clearly, uh, you just, you know, as soon as he had data on the ground, he was like, boop, 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 boop. I'm good to go. OK, scan the passport and you're done. Government enters the electronic age. Fine. I know. So I wanted to make sure to share that. I know we're we're a little over time here, whatever that means these days. But um, but super handy if you're doing any international travel. And uh, I wanted to make sure everybody everybody knew about it.